Understanding Seasonal Allergies, an English Learning Guide. Hello everyone, today, we're going to explore a very common health topic, seasonal allergies. We'll break down what this phrase means, why it's important, and how you can discuss it in English. Whether you're dealing with these allergies yourself or just want to understand more about them, this video is for you. Seasonal allergies, also known as hay fever or allergic rhinitis, are allergy symptoms that occur during certain times of the year. They are usually caused by an allergic reaction to outdoor substances like pollen from trees, grasses, and weeds. The key here is that these allergies are seasonal, meaning they happen at specific times of the year, typically during spring, summer, or early fall. Understanding the symptoms is crucial. Common signs include sneezing, runny or stuffy nose, itchy eyes, nose, or throat, and watery eyes. Some people might also experience fatigue due to the disruption caused by these symptoms. Knowing these terms can help you describe your condition in English or understand others discussing their symptoms. Discussing health is a common part of everyday conversations. By understanding terms like seasonal allergies, you can better participate in discussions about health and well-being. It's also helpful for understanding advice on how to reduce exposure to allergens or for explaining why you might be feeling unwell during certain times of the year. While there's no cure for seasonal allergies, they can be managed. Common strategies include staying indoors on high pollen days, using air purifiers, and taking allergy medications. If you're discussing allergies with someone, these could be helpful tips to share or knowledge to gain. We hope this video has given you a clear understanding of seasonal allergies and how to talk about them in English. Remember, whether you're discussing symptoms, prevention strategies, or just everyday impacts, knowing these phrases can make a big difference in your conversations. Stay healthy and see you in the next video.